welcome back to the channel we're in milton georgia i've got the trailer i've got ann she's in there we're gonna be getting started soon look at this storage facility we're at an extra space storage facility it just it looks like a big house i never seen one exactly like that and look at the you gotta pull in those garages over there but when we came i've never been to this facility right here we almost passed it because you couldn't even tell it was a storage facility but i won this unit it's a 10 by 13 kind of a little bit of an odd size it's got like a little hook in the back of it i think according to this map i want it for 430 dollars so for the amount of stuff it's not a huge amount of stuff it's an all right deal but stuff's going to going kind of high right now it's the beginning of the month i'd want another unit a 10 by 30 for 480 dollars but um the next morning when i was gonna go pick it up i called up there and they had paid up but we're about to get busy loading this thing up right here we're gonna go in the big mansion house storage facility over there and see what we got all right we're here we pulled into this garage thing they got this big door right here opens up i can't go back any further because we gotta have room to open this and we're hanging out here they told me that this door won't close <laughs> as long as there's something here there's a sensor so hopefully they're right i'm pretty sure they're right i don't think they would, this place is pretty new that there'd be a door that would just close down but man would not be good if that thing, thing decided to close right now but we're gonna start on um, we're gonna open this thing up we gotta head up to the second floor and we're gonna go up the elevator to the second floor start loading this thing up we're here at the unit 2130 So there's stuff in there. It's not super packed, but it looks like we got hopefully a decent um, sofa set over here is what I'm, I'm hoping. There's a mattress set here. We'll see what condition it is. It's in um, lots of containers and boxes here. And there's a weird little nook in this one that there's something back there. It looks like a couch cushion. Just going to stand back there, but we'll see once we kind of move some of that stuff. couple TVs. Like I said, lots of containers, lots of shoe boxes, and I can see shoes, 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 shoe boxes. So let's see, here's a just loose shoe hanging here, a Puma. Kind of just some odd loose shoes. Let's see if there's going to actually be shoes in these shoe boxes. This is a Tommy Hilfiger box. And yeah, we got some Tommy Hilfiger boots, like rain boots. Those look pretty nice. This is a guess. It feels empty. I guess that it is empty, yeah. But they might be loose in here. I don't know. And that's a, what is that? Puma? That feels really heavy. I think there's something else in it. You hear that? And there is. A Las Vegas mug. A little casserole dish. Kind of a weird, I guess that probably would have been for some kind of boots or something to be that big. Yeah. But all right, we're about to get started loading up and we're gonna, we'll show you what we find as we go here. Oh, there's a skateboard. Let's see. Kryptonics skateboard. And go for it. Go, okay. go, go. Let's see me go. What are you doing? Dang, I tried. I was gonna do it on here because you do it. Don't fall, though. <laughs> That's the best I got. Man. I, know, I can't take you back to the auction broke, so don't fall. All right, let's get busy here. Mm. Are they Crocs? No, they're Dr. What you call them? Uh, Dr. Scholl's? Well, no. This it's a Dr. There, Scholl's yeah. box. Yeah, but it says oh, right there. Merrill, yeah. These are um, oh. pretty good shoes. They're yeah. like Croc-like, but Merrill. Yeah. <clears throat> There's a garbage bag. And it is going to have clothes. Look at this, it's a Green Bay jacket though. This Green Bay Packers jacket. And other miscellaneous clothes it looks like. Got some odd yeah, shoes, some, odd some shoes headphones. This is 
the A1. And not Rebox, but A1 steak sauce. And we got some stubs. Let's see how old this stuff is. You see a date on it? Okay, here we go. Oh, this is good all the way till 2024. This is good to February 2023. So probably this stuff hasn't been in here for that long. I don't think this facility's been, been here for that long. All right, we got a big kind of under bed storage tote here. We got wall art. Wall art says family. That's a metal one. Um, little wooden box here. Tea, it's a tea box. It's like kind of a, a decorative jar, maybe. Yeah, it's like a kind of aqua turquoise colored little decorative. Oh, it's a soap dispenser. Um, what is this? Oh, it's a vase with some flowers in it. Okay, let's move to the next one. There's part of uh, some kind of smartwatch. Piece of a band. Looks like clothes, clothes, clothes. Lots of jeans down there. Looks like some good clothes. Jeans, jeans. They're all clean. They're, they're pretty neat in here. All right. Stacy storage need to leave in front okay another empty shoe box well we got we got socks and stuff here's a pair of adidas Vince Camuto that what's in there these are like yeah these are pretty nice some sandals there right? Mark Fisher Those are in there. They've been worn, but they're in really good shape. Another Mark Fisher, this would probably be flip-flops or something. Yep. See what's in there. We got I don't even know, is that S okay, S B I C C A Vintage Collection. Gianna Beanie. Is that hair? Yeah, Some more shoes there. Okay, a purse. Yeah. Okay. New. What's the name on that bag there? Ron Rui purse. Rebecca Minkoff. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, that's got a $73 tag on it. Brand new little purse there. And some more shoes. Coach and four. I don't know. Does that have anything to do with the brand Coach at all? It's got this some little logo, but I wonder if it's just. Looks like more clothing. Clothing. Born free. Oh, yeah. And says so there's a quarter down in the bottom of that last tote. So. Clothing. But like I said before, it's, it looks like good clothing. It's nice yeah. and neat. It's clean. It's not all worn out with holes in it and stains on it. It's a nice little lamp. It looks like paperwork. Paperwork. Um, a couple books. A blanket bag. A blanket bag, oh lord. Clothes. Blanket bag with clothes. Those could end up being not clean. Oh. Stuff's falling out of this one. Paperwork, paperwork, paperwork. 
these. Yeah. So all paperwork there. That is going to be paperwork, it appears. McCoy's jackets. What is this? We got like a shell and some just like weird like sage kind of stuff. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, McCoy is a kid. This is all paper. <laughs> oh! The lights went off. We gotta find the sensor. <laughs> I think it might be down. I don't know which one of us hit it. It might be right there, yeah. <clears throat> Artistic Southern Ink Alpharetta. <clears throat> Paperwork. Um, kids book. <clears throat> Mostly paperwork though. So far, not a whole lot going in this one. <laughs> Storage mail papers. They like to put paper in here. Mm. Now see more paper, 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 paper. All right, this box here, we got a little tablet, Samsung tablet, it's like a Christmas tree skirt, and paperwork. 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 And, um, okay, we got paperwork, but what is this right here? This says Home Shopping Network, HSN. We got some jewelry here. We got a necklace and matching earrings. Heidi Doss, Heidi Doss, I'm not sure what that is, lots of, there's a bunch of little boxes here, jewelry glove, oh, what is this, it looks like it may be silver, but I don't see, I don't see any mark. Oh, there it is. Yep, 925 silver. That's a nice ring right there. And then right here, let's see. That one right there, also 925 silver. And this one's empty. That one's empty? Yeah, lucky me. I get the empty one. Don't touch any more because you make them empty when you yeah, touch them. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Empty. There's another one. It's got one earring in it. It's kind of weird. Oh. What's this down in there? I don't know. This and I just dropped it out. All right, let's see. Here's some rings, several rings in this one. And that one is marked. That says China. Uh, yep, 925 silver. It's got a funky little stone or something on it. Uh-oh, this one right here. 
This little ring right here says 10K, 10 karat gold right there. Looks like a like a wedding band. Like a, it'd be a very small one though. Um, and then another ring here. Let's see. This one, it's got a marking, but it's really small. I can't quite see it at the moment. All right, let's keep looking. Let's keep looking and see what we find so far. Oh, here we go. That is... That may be gold. I don't know. I'll, I'll have to look closer at this later. But on the thing here, it says... What does it say on this? Bella Lusa... Yellow pendant with chain. Well, let me look at this and just see. So, give me an idea. It says ten. It says ten k, and then another letter. I'll have to. I'll have to check on these. They might be gold. They're really thin and light, and all these, but still, they could be gold. More jewelry. That looks like it may be silver. We're gonna just kind of quickly. <clears throat> Look through the rest now. <clears throat> Excuse me. I think that's empty. Something in here. Some sort of jewelry in there. So this <clears throat> turned out to be a good little box. A few pieces of jewelry in here. And then a few empty boxes. Blue Jay Art Shop. And that looks like it could be silver. <clears throat> that right there says 18 carat. Ooh. more boxes already looked at that one more jewelry potentially gold and that's mostly empty there's a little bag here don't think that's gold but we'll definitely have to check it out empty and empty so several empties and then but there was some good stuff in there Put these back. And we will move along. Alright, so other than that, so we have the jewelry here and then a Bible. And what we got a another tablet, but it's busted all to pieces. And more paperwork. Oh, you got more jewelry? More boxes in a and a key. We can find the card and the key. Okay, let's see what we got here. <laughs> so there's more jewelry boxes. Ooh, look at that. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that's definitely going to be silver, I think. That is so pretty. And it says, see a marking there. It's hard to make it out, but I think it's pretty sure it's going to be 925 silver. So lots of um, silver pieces. Looks like some gold pieces. All the gold stuff's pretty pretty thin, not real heavy, but that's but it's still good. So yeah, lots of jewelry in here too. Lots of jewelry. And some empty boxes also. And a, a Batman bow. And the key to a car. I don't know, maybe the car will be back there in that little hall. Yeah, maybe it's parked back there. <laughs> I don't know how they got it on the elevator, but. It's a little more jewelry, so. Let's see, it might be a trend. Maybe she was a jewelry person and that had H and HSN boxes, but it says shoes, so Stacy Shoes Storage. 
fit flop. This is some kind of flip flops. Nope. <laughs> well, kind of look like Vans type shoes. And that one is empty. Let's see what this is down here. Look at the shoe box. Mm -hmm. Look, we got some shoes. Uh, Jessica, Jessica Simpson shoes. Is that a leather jacket? Yeah, and uh, I don't even think it's leather. Yeah, I think it might be. It feels like it might. Yeah. What does it say there? Um, no, it is not leather. Really? Leather. Polyurethane. <laughs> but it's a brand new little jacket. It's nice. Yeah. It doesn't feel real plasticky like a lot of times that will. But Like a rug. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yep, totes with locking lids. Rug. We got a frame picture, but that looks like a personal family picture, so we won't look close at that. And some little decorative pieces down here. Most likely going to be clothes in here, and yes, it is clothes. There's a Doc Martin sandal, one of them anyways. Whether the other one's gonna be here in, or not, we don't know yet. We got some dryer sheets, and a bunch of shims, like little wooden shims or something here. Starting to get full on the carts here, so we're about to have to go take a load down to the trailer. This says kitchen seasoning. Everybody puts their seasonings in storage. We get more spices and stuff. They don't throw them away and they don't take them with them. They always put them in storage. And that's exactly what it is. McCormick's, salt, pepper, all that stuff. They didn't mind what it was, huh? Mm-hmm. All right, see, we still got quite a few more boxes on this side, more boxes over here. Um, end up seeing what the mattress and couch looks like at some point, too. Of course, more shoes. Lots of shoes and clothes. And this one does have the shoes in it. Let's see. Nautica. And we're in the dark again. There we go. There's a little bit of light. You gotta get down, down that way, I think. Yeah. Yeah, Nautica boots. Still have the tag on it. Here's a Steve Madden box. Let's see. Yep, we got some Steve Madden. Look at these things. Got some disco looking boots here. And one more box down in there. More shoes. Vince Camuto. And yep. There's some boots down there. It looks like some more go-go boots. <laughs> Don't know what it looks like. Got a little <clears throat> tiny bit of Christmas stuff in that box. Not much. Kitchen storage. And then an Adidas box. Yeah, we got some utensils. Kitchen silverware. And another Adidas box. This silver is in there, maybe. And here we got little clips and utensils, ice cream scoop.
storage tea kitchen. And it's tea. Boxes of tea. When they put something on the box, that's what that's what it is. They don't play around. A lot of people you open the box and it's like almost never what they yeah. say. But for the most part, these people it is. One more box here and then we're gonna head down and load this stuff up. Oh, never mind. That one says jewelry on it, so we're gonna oh, well, no, we're so, not so we're gonna open that after we open this right here, which this just looks like it's um, okay, we got matches, envelopes. Look at these little cans, though. These are cool. Vodka. Yeah. Class American Vodka. I don't know if that's like a real vodka or if that's just a decoration type thing or what. No idea. And a bunch of Peach State Lumber pencils. Okay. So, so the box yeah. up here so you don't have to yep. let's see what is in the jewelry box that's jewelry storage okay let's see Saluna stones. It feels like there's nothing in this box. Oops, and I just ripped them down. Okay, there's nothing in there. Goovin Brothers fine jewelry. Right, let's see. Goovin Brothers. Oh, look, the box lights up. Oh. It's got a built-in light, see? That's awesome. All right, what is this? Let's see. Okay, it's definitely, it's at least silver. The marking's small. I can't make out the marking, though. But it's definitely at least silver. I can tell. I can tell by the marking that it's, could be, could be gold. White gold. Paper. Okay. So that is these are pretty nice these bracelets here. Saluna stone. Okay, that's that first bag. Oh, okay. That right there. All right, let's put that back in there. So, all right, look at this. This is a really cool jewelry box right here. Even though they wrote with it on a pen, with a pen right there. Ambrosia maple font front maple front valentine box $55 okay let's see is there going to be nothing in it is that is that a piece of jewelry sticking out or just can't quite tell there's something in here okay yeah i don't know right off hand if this is any kind of gold or what but um it's definitely got a marking there on the on the class oh, very small one up sorry let me go turn them on these lights are on a very short timer here most places they go much longer than this all right we got a jewelry stand here all right and there's a container down here let's see Okay, this one feels like it has actually some stuff in it, maybe. Oh, and it's full of jewelry boxes. That's heavy. Now, this is full of some kind of bracelet with the coins. Several different pieces here. Some earrings. Okay.
maybe a lot of costume here. I don't know. It's from TJ Maxx. If that's, if that's correct, if it hadn't been mixed up. Okay, nice stuff. It looks like a lot of um, costume jewelry in these boxes. But there's probably some other stuff mixed in. Like that looks silver right there. Believe that's going to be sterling silver. There it is. Yep, 925 sterling on that ring there. Um, probably probably the same on this one. Yep, 925 sterling on that ring. Some earrings there. Costume. Oh, empty. Empty. <laughs> I think this one's empty. <laughs> Sorry for the ugly bubble mailer. I made it out of a piece of used mailer to help save the planet. Okay, they must have bought this like online or something. And it's empty. So some empty. Trend continues. They like to put empty boxes in there. So more jewelry. So a lot of costumes. Some silver. Maybe a little gold. I don't like those anymore or not. We're probably skipping over a box or two here or there, but this one's full of something. Look, it's got one of these real big CB pieces in it, yeah, and several other things. Got several pieces in that one. Empty. Okay, we already looked at that. And like I said, there's more stuff down in there what is this uh daisy fuentes yeah. i've heard the name i don't know if, yeah. that, if those are worth anything but. um they seem to be real popular right now anything in there. oh yeah and more costume there's more stuff down in the bottom there Empty. Empty. so we're probably missing a little something here because we're just kind of real quick going through the boxes. There's probably a box or two that we missed there, but um, stay tuned if we find something. Good. Yeah, <laughs> but overall, some good stuff in the box some sterling silver and costume and other stuff like the jewelry holder and this nice little wooden heart shaped, semi heart shaped jewelry box there. Going down, what if we go, what if we go out there and the doors down the truck smashing it? <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be bad now i can still i can see the door from here it's still open just took a load down back for another load so also i just noticed if you're seeing this yellow mark on my fingernail right there that's actually from acid from testing um from the gold testing kit i got a little bit of the acid on my fingernail testing some gold from another unit since i was showing close-ups there on that jewelry I figured I'd just let you know in case you were wondering I didn't try to paint my fingernail some weird yellow in that one spot but all right let's see what else we're gonna find here storage Stacy and clothing definite theme but it's not bad lots of jeans jeans are always good jeans always so people love jeans and Jeans are expensive to go buy at the store. It looks like more shoes here. Let's see. We got, we got a purse. Got some wear around the handle. And okay, we got some nice Adidas. Well, it said that it's got some kind of marks on them. Okay, we got um Adidas box here that has Nikes in it. Diesel. We have some diesel. Nope, we actually have some Nike Airs here in the diesel box. And we have a Calvin Klein box, but who knows what we're going to find here. And it's sparkly. Maybe these are Calvin Klein. But there's only one in there. What the heck? <laughs> and some common, <laughs> common sense. They're just some basic black, kind of like dress shoes, women's dress shoes. All right, let's get these back into here. Oh, 
that was stupid. That was stupid of me right there. Lots of change. We'll clean all this up. Rolling container looks like cleaning supplies. Mm -hmm. Empty, there's stuff in there, so yeah. everywhere from empty to full and yeah. and in between. But it looks like most of it was at least somewhat used. Kitchen. What's that? Okay, oh it's like a it's a Cuisinart like bread box. Oh, it's a metal bread box. And we got some um like some different like cookware down in the bottom there. And this one here says pots and pans. Looks like a lot of plasticware. Yep. Plasticware. Um there is a nice like a pretty nice pot down there with a chopper, wooden bowl, kind of worn out. So far, their dishes seem kind of all somewhat mixed up. I've seen a lot of different stuff, but they've got some of the temptations dishes and the mattress <laughs> okay yeah mattress is in bad shape too it's got stains all over it so overall it's kind of it's kind of not looking too great on this one because the furniture this stuff's just project piece of junk sofa it's not in great shape mattress not in great shape box spring it's like they usually are it's definitely sellable got the couple tvs got a little bit of jewelry lots of clothes and shoes um decent i guess decent overall unit definitely i wouldn't call it bad wouldn't call it good just decent kind of just average this is one you really want to be paying more like 100 150 bucks for instead of 400 and something dollars but that's it on this one there are still the boxes of stuff for us to go through that have um, dishes and everything. But that's pretty much all it is, is different dishes, pots and pans and dishware and everything. So, I mean, once we get it out, it'll piece out and be stuff we can sell. But nothing that I think is worth waiting to show for this video here. But that's it for this one. Hopefully, there'll be better units later on you can watch. But if you like this one, give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and you'll have a good one.